Well, it's March, and that means it's time for another Keto Box opening. And we're going to eat it all right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Joe. And I'm Anthony. And this is Two Crazy Ketos. And here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos. We do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics. And then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. Now, you can find us on all kinds of social media like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. That's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel and make sure you hit that little bell button so that you are notified every time we upload a new video. So it is March, like I said, and that means it's time for another keto box opening. But we're gonna do it a little different this month. So normally, if you've seen our channel before, Rachel and I open up these boxes, we go through everything that's in it, how much it costs, what's in it. Well, this month, instead of Rachel and I, you've got... It's your boy. Anthony it's and It's your myself. boy, Anthony. This is Anthony. This is our middle son, if you're new to our channel. It was supposed to be Anthony and Caleb. But he chickened out. He chickened out. He had some things to do, so it's just going to be the two of us. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go through the box. We're going to see what's in it, tell you how much it costs, go over the nutrition on everything, but then... We're going to try everything that's in this box. So you're going to kind of see how does it taste from a keto person and from a non-keto person. So I'm excited about this. Now, if you don't know what a keto box is, this is a monthly subscription box. Yeah. And basically it comes with 8 to 12 treats every single month. I like it because we get to try new things. It's also a way to kind of control how many treats you're eating every month. Rachel and I look at it, whatever's in this box, that's what we get for the month, and then we're done. Uh, if you're interested in it, there's a link down below. It's like $40 a month, and there's also a coupon code, which is 2CrazyKetos, that will get you a discount off of your first month. So you ready? Yeah. Okay. So, ooh, I'm looking right inside here. Very first thing is something that we have had before. This I haven't is, had it before. This is Ross chocolates. Let's let's move this off to the side so the camera I can put it right there, I guess. Okay. So, okay, this is Ross chocolates. These are dark chocolate thins with sea salt. These are minis. There's three servings per container. A serving is five pieces. And the ingredients in this are cocoa mass, inulin, erythritol, cocoa butter, sea salt, natural vanilla extract, stevia, and milk. So it's stevia That's sweetened chocolate. Uh, per serving, which is five pieces again, it's 120 calories, 11 grams of fat, uh, one gram of protein, 14 total carbs, eight grams of dietary fiber, five grams of sugar alcohol. So that is uh, one net carb per five pieces. So that is pretty good. So you ready? We're gonna try. We're gonna try each one as we go along, right? Yeah. You can Are you sure you want to start on the Good chocolate, and not end on the chocolate? I guess we're gonna start. I on don't the really chocolate. know what's in here, so. Okay, so now the price on this. The only thing that I can find online is on Amazon, and it is fairly expensive. So this bag is forty dollars. <laughs> <coughs> it is. It is forty dollars for this bag. Forty dollars on Amazon. Okay, so it's a little chocolate, and again, it's five of these is your serving. Are you laughing at the taste, or are you laughing at the $40? $40 for this? <laughs> it's a chocolate. I'm going to win chocolate and get a better piece for that. Well, there are 15 pieces in here. I don't know. I mean, okay. it's good. Ain't no forty dollars, good. Taste wise, it's very good. I will say it is very, very good taste wise. Now these are made in Canada, and I also want to say, just in case you're considering purchasing them, if you've got money to throw around, if you've got money to throw around, uh, they have two different kinds. They have the ones that are uh, sweetened with stevia. They also have an entire line that are sweetened with maltitol. So make sure you're not ordering those. Get the stevia ones, especially if you're on keto. So what's up? What's next? Your boy's got some ginger beer. Ginger beer. I don't know what. It is. It's not beer. It's there's no alcohol on it. I'm no. not 21. Well, it's, gin it's like it's ginger it. ale. So craft ginger beer reads all natural, zero sugar, 
extra. Okay, now I did look online. I did go through, by the way, the entire box just so I can pull up the prices to make this a little bit faster. Um, I cannot find <clears throat> the price on this anywhere. I did find Target sells it in glass bottles and Fancy. in Target, it was $6 for four glass bottles of it. But that was not the zero sugar. It was just the regular one with sugar. Okay. This should be the same price. It should be the same price. So the ingredients in this are sparkling filtered water, proprietary natural sweetener blend, which is erythritol, sweet uh, stevia, and monk fruit. Then we have ginger root, lemon and lime juices from concentrate, natural flavoring, and spices. So I like the fact that, number one, there is no caramel coloring in it, so that is good. And they're using erythritol, stevia, and monk fruit. So it is serving size is one can, 12 ounces per can, two grams of fat, zero protein, 18 total carbohydrates, less than one gram of dietary fiber, 18 grams of erythritol. That oh, is okay. a lot of erythritol. I was going to say. That is so like, where did it redeem itself in there? That is a lot of erythritol. So it says demand real Enjoy our world-famous Jamaican-inspired recipe crafted with real fresh ginger root and now with zero sugar and zero calories. Are you ready? Yeah. Who's first? I'll try it. You're going first? Don't spit it all over my computer. Oof, this smells rough. Fun fact, I get stomach aches when I have ginger or smell it. It does the opposite on me. I love ginger ale, so... <laughs> That's ginger I'm going to say you're not a ginger ale person. This is good. If you, like, my, I remember growing up, my dad loved, like, Vernon's ginger ale or ginger beer. This is really good. It's got oh, a good God. flavor. But it is ginger. It is ginger. Oh, man. I don't like That is it. good. It's actually kind of really sweet. It is sweet, but it, it ain't for me. It is very sweet. Like, a little too sweet for not me. Not for me. Not for me. Well, it is made from fresh ginger. Yeah. No. Okay. Next up. I got some seeds. Seeds. It what looks like got? it's a peacock. <laughs> Iata. What's a what? It's an Iata. That's not a bird. No. Iata. Iata. Iota. Be, there's a bird on here. There's a bird on there. But, but what? It, what's the there's bird for? There's sunflower seeds. So what's the bird for? I don't know. It's their logo. Okay. Okay. So... It says, here at Iata, we know that small can be mighty. Our kernels are so good. Right. I get it. What? Because it's um, it, it's like a seed and birds eat seeds. Okay. I got it. Okay. It I says, it. our kernels are a good source of fiber and protein and pack more nutrients per calorie than most nuts. Super flavor, super crunch, super food. It says, you can always count on a roasted and salted sunflower kernel to hit the spot. But we've used pink Himalayan salt, renowned for its mineral content. Who says you can't improve on an original? So the ingredients in this are organic sunflower kernels, pink Himalayan salt, and sunflower oil. So they're roasting them in oil. Servings per container, two in this pouch. That's a lot, though. It's hard to yeah, get a lot of is. sunflower seeds. I'm going to say that. Uh, 170 calories per serving. So if you eat the whole thing, it's 340 calories. 15 grams of fat, 6 grams of protein, 6 total carbs, 3 grams of dietary fiber. So it is 3 net carbs. So if you eat the entire pouch, you're eating 12 total carbs and... Uh, six net carbs. I do like the fact that it's... Having trouble over there? Well, I missed the thing, but it is, like, got a... It's got a zip bird on lock. it. It's got a Ziploc. It's got a so bird. that you can close it back up. It's got a Ziploc, but it's also got a bird on yes, it. Yes, it's got a bird on it. See, it's got a bird. You ready? Here yeah. you go. That's a little much, isn't it? Now, if you're smart, you'll eat, like, one or two seeds at a time to make it go longer. Who is one seed at a time? What are you, a bird? <laughs> Ain't no bird. They're not very salty, are no, they? No, I don't really taste any salt. They're okay. I mean, they're sunflower seeds. They need more salt. But I'd add a lot more salt. But again, I'm now, yeah. wait. I was going to say I'm keto, so I like everything salty, but you're not. They need some salt. And they, they definitely need more salt. Doesn't say salt on here. No, no. It needs okay. some more salt. I'm gonna say that. Okay. Not bad. Price on these: twenty dollars for eight pouches on Amazon. So, or that's not bad. Two dollars fifty cents a pouch. That's not bad. 
Honestly, and I probably would not eat the whole pouch in a sitting. No. Rachel might, but I don't think I would. Yeah, I wouldn't. I don't I wouldn't. Next up. Goodies. Still sweet snickerdoodle cookie mix. You said it wrong. What? It's good D's. Good D's. Good D's. I know. Not goodies. Good D's. Good D's. Good D's. Good D's. Good D's. So uh this is a cookie mix and um I'm not, we're not going to bother making yeah, this. No, no. So, a little bit about this, though. The ingredients in this are almond flour, erythritol, soluble tapioca fiber, coconut milk powder, cinnamon, baking soda, cream of tartar, salt, and stevia. Rachel and I have had some of the other mixes. I don't think we've had the snickerdoodle cookie, but we've had other ones. So, the way this works is you're basically going to add to this one egg and a quarter of a cup of melted butter or coconut oil and a teaspoon of vanilla extract. You add that to this whole thing. And then you have cookie mix. Huh. Kind of like those cookie cups, but you're yeah. going to get a bunch of them at once. Yeah. So it makes 12 cookies. <clears throat> uh, each cookie, if you make it as prepared, is 110 calories, 10 grams of fat, 3 grams of protein, 9 total carbohydrates, Three grams of dietary fiber, five grams of erythritol, which makes it one net carb per cookie. That's not bad. Now, when you compare that to those cookie cups that we did. Four. Get out of here. Which were four, and these are going to be a lot more filling. She's saying two net carbs, but I'm going nine total carbohydrates, and five plus three is eight. Right? So nine You've minus got nine eight. Nine minus three minus, yeah. Nate. So she's got two net carbs on the front. But according to the nutrition label, it's one net carb. Mm. But you know what? I'll go with two just to be safe. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's at the bottom. Okay. So, yeah, that's kind of the, funny. The front is wrong. On the front, it says two net carbs. But on the back, it says one net carb. But, okay, so the price on these, $12 per pouch. So, dollar a cookie. Yeah, that's not bad. Not bad. Next up. Dang. Dang! I got to do mom's thing. She's right. better at it. She's, of course she's better at it. She's better at all that kind of Coconut stuff. Coconut chips. I don't know if I'm going to like this. So we've had, they've got some other ones that are just salted. <clears throat> this is a flavor. This is tropical mango dang coconut chips. So let's see. The ingredients in this are coconut mango juice, sea salt, citric acid, natural mango flavor, beta carotene for color, annatto extract for color, Lo Han Guo, which is monk fruit extract, stevia. Hmm. Per serving. Okay, so there are three servings in this container. <coughs> that is a lot, though. Yeah, that's a lot. So uh, per serving is 200 calories per serving. A serving size is one ounce, a little bit over one ounce. 17 grams of fat, 2 grams of protein, 11 total carbohydrates, Six grams of dietary fiber, making it five net carbs per serving. If you eat the entire bag, it's 15 net carbs and 32 total carbs and 15 net carbs if you eat the whole bag. Ready? I want to open it. You're going to open it? Price on those are $5 a bag. I Ooh. have seen them in Walmart too. That's some mango. Now we've had the other ones and I will say like... They're saying that this is three servings. I'm going to tell you, you're not going to even eat a whole serving in a sitting because they're basically just dried coconut chips. You're going to eat a few, maybe put a handful in your hand. No. I'm not a fan. I like coconut. I don't like the consistency of coconut. If you gave me a pina colada, I love it. Okay. Because I like the you're taste of coconut. You're not supposed to be drinking pina coladas. I can have a non-alcoholic. Oh, non-alcoholic one. Well, let's specify this. Now, this is a family channel. I just assumed. But, I mean, I used to have drink mixes that were, like, pina colada flavored. It's right. just pineapple and coconut. Like, this is good, but I don't like the consistency. Because coconut's got, like, that weird, like, grainy consistency, and I don't like it. Okay. I'm going to say I really, really <clears throat> like these. Um... I like the crunch. If you're like at a movie theater or something like that, you want to crunch, these are really You want to be that guy who eats something crunchy in a movie? <laughs> well, it's not a loud crunch, but it's like popcorn. Yeah. Not as loud as popcorn. <laughs> the mango flavor really comes through. It doesn't it does. overwhelm it, but 
You don't taste coconut so You taste much. the mango and then the coconut. It's, yeah, it's like mango with a back note of coconut. Yeah. So it is a good mixture of flavors. Five net carbs is a little high. 11 total carbs is a little high. However, it's a good thing you're getting some good fat from it. And I don't think that you're going to even divide this into three. I think you're going to eat probably a lot in there. maybe a half, half of, of serving at a time. So. Yeah. Now you're looking at two and a half to three net carbs. I, I think most people are not going to even eat a whole serving, including mom. Yeah. I don't won't. think she's even going to eat a whole serving. But she won't eat it because she doesn't really like coconut. But she does like the original dang chips. Just yeah. as, a, as a little treat once in a while. Okay. And again, we said $5 a bag. Next up. It is... Chase. I've never heard of it. Tropical Thunder Guilt-Free Cocktail Mixer. 30 servings. We're going to need something to mix this with. You have water. Oh, you have water. Perfect. Okay. Oh, wait. I have a seltzer water with lemon. That's with no, lemon. I'm not no. doing that. Okay. So I did look this up. And basically what it is, it's to make alcoholic drinks. So you would take like your vodka, some soda water, some uh, like scotch, something like that. They have two different flavors. They have tropical thunder and they also have a cola flavor. So what flavor am I going to This is tropical fla thunder. So, so it's going to be I mango. guess if you had vodka, maybe you'd, it'd be like kind of making almost like a screwdriver kind of thing. Vodka and orange juice. So the ingredients in this. Screwdriver? Are, Hold up. That's what a screwdriver is. You're not old enough to drink, but you don't have vodka or orange juice. That's a screwdriver. I, I've never heard of that. Yes. Citric acid, natural flavors, stevia. The writing is really small. Potassium sorbate, xanthan gum. What is a fairy supposed look to at, read? Look this? at how small that is. I can't read this. I can't either, and I'm wearing glasses. Um, a couple of words that I can't pronounce. I'm gonna put them across the bottom of the screen. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. So. It doesn't say anything. It just tells you all of the different uh, m uh, medicinal ingredients that you're going to have in here. Like, you again, you cannot even read it, but a bunch of vitamin Bs and stuff like that. It does not tell you any kind of nutrition on here as far as, like, how many calories or anything. It says on the side, add a shot of any hard liquor in a glass with ice, squeeze in one small shot, chase uh, and fill with flat or sparkling water. So we're just going to oh, basically... Oh, so I can drink it with water. You can drink it with water. Basically, it's designed to be mixing with alcohol, but you could drink it with water. So you would basically make your alcoholic drink, like put your ounce of vodka, gin, whatever, and then put your and then put a squirt of this on top with water. I want to do it. So just do a squirt. I do a little more now. Normal, up. normal squirt. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Mix it up. Yeah, it is kind of sad they're not telling you how many calories or anything. I'm assuming it's zero calories. A dose is two milliliters. I had to smell it first. <laughs> I need to make sure it's something I want to want. And I ruined my water. <laughs> that it. That tastes like there's alcohol in there. Not that I know what alcohol tastes like. It kind of tastes funky. It does. It tastes like it, it, it tastes like it tastes like no bad. No, it doesn't. It t something no. tastes wrong with it. No, I have a feeling maybe you. It won't tastes tell. like a bunch of vitamins. Yeah, I have a feeling. It tastes like a bunch of vitamins. It. I have a feeling maybe you wouldn't be able to tell if it was used in some beer or something. No. Well, if you're drinking well, a good vodka, like it's supposed to have no. No, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, price on this stuff, $20 for four of them. So $5 a piece, which would make 120 drinks. Let's move that out of the way. I need, no. I need water. I have a seltzer water with lemon. I hate seltzer water. Okay. I'll, I'll live. I have a coffee. I'm good. All right. The cookie department. Keto. Fully functional cookies. Mint condition. Ooh, I, ooh that's a good... That's a good name. Mint condition. I like that. Double chocolate chip plus mint. Three to one keto friendly. What does that mean? I don't know. We've had this company before. I think in years, a uh, long time ago, Rachel and I had a birthday cake flavor from this company. Okay. So it says, do you miss mint chip ice cream and chocolate lava cake? 
Uh, when you have a craving for those things, indulge in this thing because the cookie department's mint condition has one gram of sugar and four net carbs. Ingredients in this are almond flour, monk fruit sweetener, which is erythritol, monk fruit extract, grass-fed, unsalted butter, whole eggs, prebiotic fiber, which is tapioca syrup, which could possibly be another word for isomaltose oligosaccharides. Uh, dark chocolate chips, which is unsweetened chocolate and erythritol, cocoa butter, stevia extract, sunflower lecithin. We have cocoa powder processed with alkali, contains less than 2% of rosemary extract, baking soda, xanthan gum, natural flavorings, and salt. I had to drink it. I couldn't. I couldn't. Okay. I couldn't deal with that other flavor anymore. 210 calories per cookie, 18 grams of fat. Uh, five grams of protein, 21 total carbohydrates, six Oof. grams of dietary fiber, 11 sugar alcohols, making that, what Oof. is that, 17, oh. four net carbs? Four. Is that what it says yeah. on here? So four, four net carbs. They do it on the front say palm oil free, macro friendly, non GMO. I'd love to know if they're using IMO fiber in here. I have a feeling it is. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, price on these. Should we look at the price before or after we taste it? Before. I'm going with a negative. No, 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 after. I'm after. going with a negative mentality. Now, I will say that is a big cookie. It's a good looking cookie. Mm, I don't know about this. It looks know. good inside. I don't know about, I don't know, I don't, I don't know, Chief. You have the big one. I don't know, Chief. <laughs> this ain't it. This ain't it, Chief. Ew. That ain't it. Ew. That ain't it. Ew. Tastes like I just, I, tastes like I just dumped First a whole all, bottle of toothpaste in my mouth. It's not even that minty to me, but it's very bland. Yeah. And at the end, like... Chocolate lava cake. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. At the end there, though, the I don't know about you, the amount of cooling I'm getting from erythritol right yeah. now. Yeah. It, it's like my mouth is cold. Yes. My mouth is cold. It's like, yeah. Like, the amount of erythritol that's in that is way too much. Yeah. There's too much in there. I'm not eating that. Mm -mm. Uh, price on these. Let's see how much. Let's see how, how good it's going to do of not. Uh, oh, I'm my gosh. I'm buy this. I'm never buying this, probably. Where is it? $30 for eight cookies. <laughs> But he, no. the, you can't let the dog get that. That's chocolate. Oh, okay, she's, she's locked gated in there. Away. She's gated away. Three, chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Three dollars and seventy five cents a no, cookie. No, no, no. That ain't it. No, that ain't how we do it. No, ain't how we do it. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Moon cheese. Now this is, here's a good product. Yeah, I'll eat this. I'm gonna just I'm gonna just open. This. Well, we wait. We gotta what? read the ingredients first. Uh, something I know I'll like though. Okay, ingredients in this are cheddar cheese. Which is pasteurized milk, cheese culture, salt, enzymes, and annatto, which is vegetable coloring. So that's it. It's cheese. Serving, I love the individual packet because you don't really do these, but it's so easy to overindulge. Is that one serving? On, this is one serving. Oh, I eat that. So I love this. And there, you can tell, there is yeah, a, lot a lot in, in this. Even like you love Keto Farms, like compare this to Keto Farms. You get a lot right. in there. Uh, 170 calories, 14 grams of fat, 11 grams of protein, one total carbohydrate, one gram of dietary fiber. You ready? Yeah. I'm ready to have something good. Now your mom likes those, so make sure you save a few. I don't think I've ever had cheddar cheese flavor. Those are good. I always like to add more salt to them. Yeah, I was going to say. I remember them being a lot more salty. Or because you add salt to them. Yeah. Okay. These are good though. Oh, good. So price on these, if you buy them in the packets like this, $24 for 12 packets. It's two and, bucks. Which is on Amazon. And again, I like that. You're paying for the individual packaging, but to me, it's a, just a good way for me to control myself and not eat too much at once. Because you give me a big bag of moon cheese, I'm eating it all. Yeah. So, that's good. Next up. Monk pack. Ha! A chipmunk. <laughs> <laughs> Man, they're really going hard with the coconut flavors, aren't they? They're going all in with this thing. So that is what? A coconut, keto granola bar. A coconut cocoa chip flavor. 
Four grams of protein, plant-based, grain-free, gluten-free, one gram of sugar, two grams of... Here you go. I'll let you read it. You're I'm going to read the back. You're, you're so good at it. I'll let you keep doing it. Okay. So this has allulose in it because it's telling you on the back the little allulose thing. I want to put in perspective how bad that drink thing is. I'm drinking this. This is TV static. I don't ever drink this. But it's bad because you don't like ginger beer. No. No, I'm, I'm talking, talking about this thing. Oh, that stuff. I thought you were talking about the ginger beer. No, I can tolerate that. <laughs> I was tolerating that. It's just ginger. <coughs> okay, so the ingredients in this are almonds, uh, coconut, allulose, or coconut and then allulose, soluble tapioca fiber, palm oil, vegetable glycerin, natural flavors, sea salt, alkalized cocoa powder, unsweetened chocolate, cocoa butter, mixed tofurols, which is vitamin E for freshness, sunflower lecithin, monk fruit extract, it's sustainably sourced. Uh, and then you have allergens, contains almonds, coconut, and milk. Serving size is one bar, 140 calories per serving, 13 grams of fat, 4 grams of protein, 12 total carbohydrates, 4 grams of dietary fiber, 0.5 grams of glycerin, which actually is considered a sugar alcohol. And then on the back it's saying there's 12 carbs minus 4 grams of fiber minus 5.5 grams of allulose minus 0.5 grams of glycerin makes it 2 net carbs. So I'm gl I am glad that it's not super fiber heavy because I was worried about that soluble tapioca fiber. It does have palm oil, which I'm not super happy about. But uh, price on these? Oh, we, we do it afterwards, After. right? Looks like a cookie. It smells very coconutty. I'm gonna give you a piece with the chocolate chips. It's almost like a macaroon consistency. I don't know if I want to. I don't like coconut. The consistency of coconut, though. No, no, it's not like that. That's good. This it's is exactly good. what I said. I didn't like. I don't like the consistency of coconut. But the, it, it is good. It is good. You just don't like the texture. You're a texture. So if you like macaroons, this is like the type. This is like a macaroon. It's actually really good. It's really good. Really good. Ingredients are like. I wouldn't eat it every day, but they're not super bad. Um, okay, I would absolutely buy these. It's not bad. Especially considering they're only 12 car carbs. They are a little small. So, I mean, we ate about a half a bar, so that's the other half. So they are a little small. Um, $25 for 12 of them. So that's only like $2 a bar, so that's, that's really not bad. So, not bad. Next up. We're nearing the end. I want to say this for last. I go I like meat. Field trip. Get out there. Crispy cuts, pork rinds, <clears throat> Parmesan peppercorn. All natural eerie puff. Yeah. Now, I think mom and I have had these before. Anthony loves pork rinds. So. I, I hated pork rinds before they started keto. Now you love them though. You eat them all the time. I know they had them when I was eight. I'm like, this is disgusting. Okay, so th these are fried pork skins, grated Parmesan cheese, which is pasteurized part skim uh, milk, cheese culture, salt enzymes, spices, including peppercorns, salt, and dehydrated garlic. So the ingredients in this are really good because usually the seasoned ones contain maltodextrin. They don't have any of that in here. And they're being fried in their own oil because there's no oils added. So that's good. So this has really good ingredients. Servings per container, two. <laughs> That's two? <laughs> two. That's two? This is one. Serving size is a half an ounce or a half a bag. So, yeah. Uh, 80 calories per serving. So, if you eat the whole bag, it's 160 calories. Six grams of fat, seven grams of protein, one total carbohydrate. So, if you eat the whole bag, it's two carbs. And that's coming from the peppercorns and the spices and the cheese. You ready? Yeah. I can't open this one. We'll get my little knife. Mom doesn't like it when I do this. They're big. They're really big. Yeah, that's good. Those are good. Oh, good. Those are really good. Okay, so I found these on Amazon. Oh, yeah. These are good. These are good. So I found them on Amazon two different ways. You can get $40 for 10 two and a half ounce bags, which this is a 
one ounce bag. So that's not bad at all. So this is a one, so it would be two and a half of these bags. You get 10 of them. So that would be the equivalent of, what is that? 25 of these bags for 40 bucks, right? Is oh yeah, right? Good, yeah. Right, two and a half, ten, two and a half ounce bags. That would be like a dollar fifty a bag. Yeah, or you could get uh, fifteen dollars for six of these bags. So it's obviously cheaper. Now that was like assorted flavors, though. But forty dollars for ten two and a half ounce bags, which is two and a half of these. So like basically big bags of pork. If rinds. you're not a fan of pepper, I wouldn't get it. No, they are very They're peppery. Very peppery. All right, last one. I want another piece. Last one. Mission meats, beef sticks. Are the ingredients and nutrition really on here? Small, yeah. You're gonna need me to read it. Oh, I need you to read it. Yeah. Okay. Ingredients. I do have glasses, you know. I'm not that old. Beef, water, salt, encapsulated citric acid, cultured celery powder, celery powder and sea salt, black pepper, red pepper, garlic powder, coriander, onion powder, stuffed and beef collagen casing. So good ingredients. Good ingredients. Is it grass-fed beef? 100% grass pet fed grief, no added nitrates or nitrates. Um, gluten free, no MSG, paleo friendly. Is There's there no, any nutrition no on there? Nutrition no on nutrition there. on there. Okay, let's rip that thing open. <laughs> I'll give you the one that didn't fall on the table. Hmm. Not bad. It's kind of flavorless. Yeah, it kind of tastes like dog food. <laughs> Not that I know what dog food tastes like. It's got a kind of funky taste to it. Not bad. I mean, it's I'm not bad, it. but... I mean, I'll eat it for you. It's not bad, but... Oh, wait. I don't know if that's the salt, if it's the pepper from the... Oh, no, it's coming to it, me now. It, is it coming through as a little spicy at the end? Nope. Okay, no, I'm just checking. Then, then it's just the uh, pork rinds. It's not bad. No, I mean, the more I eat it, I think it's getting better. Yeah, right? no, it's got some red pepper. It's got some flavor. It's got some heat to it. I don't know if you want. Let's have one more bite. It's my problem. You put food in front of me, I just eat it. Yeah, they're not bad. They're not bad. Okay, price on these. $21 for 12 sticks on Amazon. So that's, nope. That's the normal price of a meat stick. Man, that's expensive. That's the normal price for a meat that's, stick. That, we're not talking about Slim Jims here. We're talking about grass-fed beef. I don't know. Give most, me a Slim Jim. I like me a Slim Jim. Most, most beef sticks are about $2 a beef stick. So that's everything? Yeah. Now, they do give us a couple of coupon things in here. So they give you a little coupon card with discounts on everything, like 20% off of goodies, 20% off of the moon cheese. Ooh, 20% off of those monk packs. You could get a dollar off of the reeds and 20% off of your favorite drink mix. <laughs> uh, yeah, pretty much 20% off of everything. You can get 25% off of that chocolate. It's $40. Not that I'd still even pay that price. They also give us a coupon available online. How about snacks.com? Use the code the keto box and get 20% off of a trail mix. It's a nuts, chocolate, and coconut trail mix. So. That's interesting. So, well, that is going to be our video for today. Let us know down in the comments section if you've tried any of these products. And if you haven't, which one would you be interested in trying? Also, let us know if you've tried these cookies before. Oh, God. These ones here. No. So, no. please do us a favor. Hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And hit the little bell icon so that you are notified every single time we upload a new video. Also, let us know down in the comment section if you like this format where Anthony and I or maybe Caleb, we try all of these different things all at once. Until next time, bye. bye.